Sandy Brehal was required to be involved in and aware of the preparation for and clean up after Harvey Weinstein's extremely prolific sexual encounters, her Manhattan federal court suit says. Another task MS. Rehal was forced to do to aid Harvey Weinstein's sexual encounters was to clean up the semen on the couch in Harvey Weinstein's office on a regular basis, the suit says. But the married 65-year-old Shakespeare in Love producer needed a boost to consummate the frequent trysts, so Rehal provided that too, she says in court papers. She had to obtain the shots and keep them stocked in a cabinet behind her desk at Harvey Weinstein's TWC office, the suit says, using the initials of the Weinstein Company. Every time Harvey Weinstein went to meet a woman at a hotel, in the office, or elsewhere, which occurred on average at least three times a week, when he was in New York, Ms. Rihal was required as part of her job to provide him with a shot, which she placed in his jacket pocket or in a brown paper bag, the suit states. After he'd administer the cringe-worthy injection and have sex with a stable of girls that Rihal maintained in a list, she'd retrieve the used syringes and condoms from hotel rooms before housekeeping personnel would do their work, the suit says. The list, called Harvey's Friends, had the women's names with asterisks next to his favorites. The 11-page suit includes additional sickening details about Weinstein allegedly rubbing his large belly against his young assistant, groping her thighs and buttocks and demanding that she take dictation of his emails while he was naked. Rehal started wearing pants, she says in the suit. AG allegedly responded by complaining, you used to dress so cute and now what's going on? He demeaned his assistant by calling her a C, T and a P. Why, in front of other company staff, and reminded them who was the boss, the suit says. He bragged about his power, stating to MS. Rehal and other employees, I'm Harvey Weinstein and you are at Weinstein University. I decide whether or not you graduate, court papers state. On oh, numerous occasions he uttered, What's wrong, Sandeep? Is the tampon up too far today? Rihal worked at TWC for two years before quitting in February 2015 because she couldn't take it anymore. She says in the suit that as a result of the hostile work environment caused by the incessant sexual harassment, Ms. Rihal has suffered and continues to suffer from severe emotional distress, anxiety, depression, humiliation, fear, anguish, and loss of self-esteem, the filing states. She's suing Weinstein, the Weinstein Company and the firm's executives for unspecified damages.